Today's Army faces challenges that reach far beyond the traditional battlefield. With a consistently evolving warfare landscape, the enemy's reach is no longer limited to geographical constraints. As one of the most technologically advanced nations in the world, our sophisticated weapon systems, satellites, navigation, and aviation systems are reliant upon an infrastructure of vast stores of information in networked computer-based systems and databases. Our adversaries are attacking and attempting to exploit our networks around the clock, searching for vulnerabilities to jeopardize our mission and disrupt our way of life. Just one stealthy piece of malicious code could have devastating and costly effects. The Army relies on intelligent, highly skilled service men and women to support and defend these crucial and complex systems against threats both foreign and domestic. Protecting information is very essential to the Army now and it's going to be a very important field and it's a growing field. As a soldier working in military occupational specialty, cyber operations specialist, you will serve on the front lines of the cyberspace battlefield, enabling and executing both defensive and offensive cyberspace operation, ensuring the freedom of maneuver within the cyberspace domain and denying that same advantage to our adversaries. The way the world operates today with technology, you don't have to fight somebody one-on-one. -on -one. You don't have to follow that traditional kinetic warfare. Instead, you can exploit the fact that one computer system has a vulnerability. After completing 10 weeks of basic combat training, you will complete two phases of advanced individual training. Phase one takes place over 25 weeks at the Quarry Station Naval Technical Training Center in Pensacola, Florida, followed by 20 weeks of phase two training at the U.S. Army Cyber School at Fort Gordon, Georgia. The Army will train you in a number of valuable skills, such as performing cyber attacks and defenses, cyber intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance actions on specified systems and networks networks, conducting network terrain audits, penetration testing, collecting and analyzing basic digital forensics data and software threat analysis to react to cyberspace events and employ cyberspace defense infrastructure capabilities and to provide incident response impact assessments and produce network security posture assessment. You will also learn to analyze computer system and network architecture and determine and implement exploitation and defensive methods. We get to be on the cutting edge of a lot of technology and a lot of tactics that haven't really been exposed inside of the civilian industry. They may not get to see the things that we're using for several years. Due to the highly sensitive nature of this MOS, qualifying soldiers must meet top secret sensitive compartmented information access eligibility requirements, as well as pass a counterintelligence scope poly graph. The unparalleled training and experience gained while serving in this MOS can prepare you for a wealth of opportunities in the civilian workforce. The skills you will acquire are in high demand. We get an opportunity to work with the industry a lot. We always get an opportunity to see what our civilian counterparts are doing as far as defending their networks, and these people remember who you are. Join the Army's most technologically advanced career field as one of an elite team of world-class cyber warriors committed to combating our nation's ever-present and growing cyberspace threat. Military Occupational Specialty, Cyber Operations Specialist.